Frequency Matters, the RF and Microwave Update Series. I'm Pat Hindle. I'm here with my co-host, Gary LaRue, and special guest, Scott Vasquez, Senior Product Line Manager at Corvo. Welcome. Thank you. It's the first day of IMS uh, 2019 in Boston, so the mayhem is beginning. <laughs> yes, it is. So we have uh, probably 5G and IoT will be the hottest topic here. Uh, what kind of traction are you seeing for your products in those areas? Right. So um, the 5G market is extremely interesting right now. There's a lot of activity that we're seeing. Um, both globally and domestic. Um, Corvo is well positioned to address um, all of those markets um, with some of our products. We have a family of millimeter wave uh, GAN devices that have been released over the past year, year and a half uh, at 39 and 28 gigahertz. And um, for 5G domestically, those have been a very interesting uh, solution that we brought to the market. Uh, great efficiency, small size, with got a nitride, um, enabling less complex systems, so uh, they've really been a, 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 a family of standout products for, for Corvo on the millimeter wave 5G uh, front. So there are sort of two camps that have evolved in the world of 5G around millimeter wave. One, like yourselves, promoting gallium nitride as the right solution for these arrays, and others that are more silicon based. So what's the argument for GAN? Right, so um, when we speak to our customers, um, we showcase a lot of the different performance characteristics of gallium nitride. So, um, higher output power per element, um, higher efficiency per device, um, like I mentioned before, smaller size um, of a device and also smaller size of a phase array. So instead of needing hundreds of elements, you may only need 64 elements with, with gallium nitride. So, these are some of the usual advantages that we tout to our customers. Um, and the, the idea of size is really important because it, it has a lot of implications for things like power consumption, for things like cost, and for things like, uh, again, complexity of, of the array um, of a millimeter of system. So those are some of the things that we, we focus on and, and customers are, are very interested in rel relative to our solutions. So besides the 5G GAN products, what other GAN technologies are you bringing to market recently, uh, aerospace and defense and commercial? Right, so um, Corvo, I think, historically is always pushing the frontier of power uh, and efficiency, in particular for uh, defense and aerospace. And so we have a lot of millimeter wave products that are being announced at the conference uh, this week. Um, parts from 32 to 38 gigahertz. Uh, we have a 10 watt device, saturated power device. Nice. Um, we have uh, a 20 watt, 27 and a half to 31 gigahertz part for SATCOM. Mm. Um, that's a really exciting device. Uh, and we also have some X-band devices as well with, with some of the highest efficiency, 45% uh, on the market with four watts of output power. So using our 0.15 micron guide metric process, we are continuing to push the envelope on output powers at these high frequencies, as well as efficiencies. Well, Scott, thank you for coming by. I'm sure there's a line gathering at your booth waiting to talk to you. We'll <laughs> let you sure. get back there. Thank you very much. So from IMS in Boston, thanks for watching.